Friday twinning. Have we got a surprise today for you ladies and boys? Hey, hey, hey! She's a broadcaster. She's an author. She's a nation's favorite. Mm hmm Toff. But she's also known as Georgia Toffolo. Let's give her a buzz. Whoa! Woo! Darling! God, this is exciting. How are you, Georgia? I'm well. I'm thrilled. This is kind of like having a cameo on your favorite sitcom. Oh. I mean, I'm starstruck. We sent you this ASOS dress. Now, what do you think? Don't show them everything yet. I have not taken this bloody dress off for the past three days since it arrived. I am obsessed. Love that. Georgia, how tall are you? I am five foot four. And you're a size eight. I'm five foot ten and I'm size twelve. And Chloe is five foot nine and I'm a size sixteen eighteen. It's really good to get all those differences. And we're just gonna start with a little bit of makeup. Mm -hmm. Now we sent you our two new flush blushes. So I thought we could just do that moment of blush. And yeah. you also did say something to me about you hardly ever wear a bright lip, right? Trini, you've hit the nail on the head. I think I've spent the last 10 years trying to eradicate redness. And then I'm like, why on earth would I put that on the lips, you know? And actually now, I think maybe I found my colour. Oh, I'm so glad. Because I think a lot of people, they do a strong lip and they think, I might not do blusher. But you need to do blusher, otherwise you're hit by a lip. I'm on it, darling. Chloe, what are you using? Which colour? Uh, I'm using Yassi. I'm using Ream. And Georgia, you're using... Darling, I'm with you with the Ream. What I call a plum terracotta. But it means I can put it slightly as if it's contour and blusher had a baby. That's what I've just done, Trini. Oh my God. <gasps> Thrilled. Thrilled. I love it. You look so good. We, we all look alive. It's a joy. It's my ride or die product, Blusher. All right, what are you doing on your eyes, darling? Because I expect you to be so quick that you'll be finished before us. Girls, I'm thinking a little bit of my old trusty favorite, Bit of Virtue. Really good. I do the whole lid in one fell swoop, including, you know that brow bone? I never know what to do with it, so I just lash it on, yeah? Yes. yes. Chloe, what are you doing, darling? I went for a really light eyeshadow, which is mystery. So just a wash of like my neutral, and then I'm gonna focus on the lid. You both look so cute. <laughs> I'm doing like that Barbara Cartland, I call it, pink and powder blue but hopefully with a modern take so i've done chalice on the eye and then i've just done that pinkiness on my lip dahlia with the lip love we haven't done this in a while picking up from the flowers of the dress i've gone and put some ream on the lip over the dye dye i'm afraid to say to give me a bit more depth of tone what about highlighter georgia because you're a highlighter queen well i've just dabbed a bit of virtue on the top of my cheek base i mean i'm quite happy that you brought this up because i have like chipmunk cheek and sometimes I worry that I put my highlighter in the wrong place. You know, there's a whole cake and bake and contour and everything, but I just feel sometimes we should really embrace that beautiful plumpness. Mm. To me, it's so beautiful. Whenever I see a woman with that really plump cheek, I just want to go like a little baby and go... Oof, 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 oof. <laughs> I thought I'd wear a hat because I just felt we needed the glamour of you. So I'm going to ask your advice. Oh, God, I never thought this day would come. Christ, come on, give it to me, Trini. Should I wear the hat with my hair down, which I feel is a bit Little Women? Oh, God, it's so me. <laughs> or I do Spanish riding school. I would do Little Women first option. Do you know why? Why? Because I'm going to do exactly the oh same. Oh, I knew you'd have one. <laughs> Oh, your makeup is looking phenomenal. Thank you. Dramatic. You're doing like the night time. And as it's quite strong, I'm going to just do a little bit more yassi, but I'm loving it. It's fabulous. And Georgia? Swainy going on, girls. It's just the perfect tone for me. Look, love. It fabulous. looks amazing. All right, darling, are you ready to see us on the catwalk? Darling, I am so ready. Friday. Tripleting. Little baby. Woo! Oh my God, and we Woo! so have lost our sheep, but we have gained Georgia and Chloe. This dress <laughs> really is like a winner. I just love it. Don't we feel girly and feminine? And we've done it all a little bit differently, which I love. It's from ASOS, but Georgia, tell me how you've styled it and why. It's for the first time I put on a swan pair and I feel so beautiful. And I think it's because of the belt and the height, the height of the platform. So helps, I couldn't resist, a little bit of kitsch. Just so me. <laughs> I'm in my element. You are, and I'm showing now, Chloe. You're doing it without a belt, actually. So, Chloe, you show because it's really 
I love the way you're wearing, but you've done something with the collar, darling. Yes, so I tucked in the collar, so it's like a deep V. I added this big, big necklace with the star, and then I'm wearing it with like a massive bag from Morocco, like straw, and then with these sandals from Santi Vade that are the same color, and I love it! And you look, Chloe, like you're on holiday already, even though you are currently in the back garden in England. Now, Georgia, in your undisclosed location, you're really living up to yourself because your heels are, what's the word, vertiginous. What does that even mean? They are Prada. They are Prada. I couldn't resist. They were 80 pounds in a secondhand shop. So dreams really do come true if you know where to look. Oh, my God. And I'm wearing very oh. old Stella McCartney's. They're what I call my nurse's shoes but in the nicest way to a nurse, just that sort of white little strappy number with solid comfort underneath. So fab. I'm ready to go on holiday now. Georgia, can we come and join you please? Okay. Jump on the plane girls, I'm waiting. Hold that chaise long now. We're coming. Everybody have a fantastic weekend. And Georgia, thank you so much for joining us. Bye, see you.